Healthy Timing and Spacing of Pregnancies project started in the year 2014. The main objective of the project is to increase access and use of voluntary family planning services within the target areas. An intervention that targets women and families to make informed decisions about delaying of the first pregnancy and uh, spacing of subsequent pregnancies with consideration of the social and cultural context and of course the fertility intentions of the uh, family. To make this possible, the project collaborates with the Ministry of Health at the national and county level. The Ministry of Health, what is doing is um, the implementation part of it, uh, whereby we do family planning methods for women of reproductive health, male and the, those in need after the training. In Garbatula, the project is being implemented in Malkadaka, Iresaburu, Sericho, and Modogashe. Community health committees and community health volunteers help in the implementation of the project at the community level. Kuhusiana na ile mafunzo tulipata kutoka shirika la World Vision, tulifanya juu na chini tukishirikiana na wazee wa vijana wenye wanajua kusoma umuhimu wake na World Vision pia vile alitufanyia training walitupatia ma booklets za zinaonyesha umuhimu wake tunakuanga na household visit tunaenda house to house tunajaribu ku challenge wa mama wa mama wengi wana wamekubali sasa the success of this project heavily relies on the support of the men in the area to make this possible local and religious leaders including teachers have to be involved we are begins to teach in this community about the child spacing from the mosque the schools or any society gathering. One Friday, I get almost 120 people in that mosque. I can, I, I can approach them through our language. We teach them this method through the Quranic system. Two and a half years or three years. Islamic Sharia accepted. 75% the method which is provided by health institutions. Islamic Sharia also accepted and it is a lawful. School health clubs are vital tools in spreading this message to peoples. With the health club itself, People are well acquainted with the knowledge of child spacing, even before they get married. So you see, it, it is something that it will, will project even to their future. For the last five years, the dropout rate has drastically dropped. And we have children, girl child especially, retained in school. The project has made positive impact in the communities. We've realized from even our registers the pneumonia cases I've been having before, nutrition cases, uh, diarrhea, used to be brought up by mothers who are really burdened with the numbers they have. having. As per our records, we've uh, realized uh, this decline in uh, the mortality rate for the maternal and um, the infant. Uh, like for instance, uh, the whole of this year, we had no case of uh, maternal death reported. This is the case of the maternal death reported. It is a case of the maternal death reported. It is a case of the maternal death reported. It is a case of the maternal death reported. It is a case of the maternal death reported. It is a case of the maternal death reported. It is a case of the maternal death reported. It is a case of wa mifugo tunakuanga na shida sana watoto wanakuwa na malnutrition mingi families are counting their blessings ukizaa mtoto upange kwa muda wa miaka miwili atalelewa vizuri economically pia mzee pia alikuwa amejipanga sasa mimi nafanya biashara kama sasa ningekuwa na zaa kila saa ndio ningekuwa kwa nyumba mara nanyonyesha mara ni mimba mara sijui what lakini sasa nafanya biashara najisaidia nyumbani Men have also embraced the project and they are now encouraging their women to take up the HTSP services. The myths surrounding modern family planning 
have been dispelled. Kwa sababu unajua hiki tuna ni foreign things yani wengine dawa ile kumeza injection coil huo yanasemekana iko na side effect. Na hiyo ilikuwa kwa watu wengi hawezi kubali kutumia hiyo hiyo method. Wanasema family plan ni mbaya inafanya watu wakue tasa. Hiyo sijui ni tasa hivi kwa kansa ile tangu na sijui hiyo family planning wamekataa wa mama wengine msituambie sisi wenyewe tunajuanga na tuta, sisi wenyewe tutatumia vile tulikuwa tunaishi zamani lakini baadaye tukawaelimisha wakaelewa wakaona umuhimu na wakaikumbatia zimpira za kina mama watu walikuwa wanasema ah hiyo anajua ikikaa huko inapotea wakati unaenda kwa mzee inapotea lakini sasa wakati watu wamepata masomo watu wakaona hiyo ni nonsense watu wakasema hakuna kitu inapotea huko even with the success of this project challenges were still encountered one of our greatest challenge is a language barrier there are those clients that would want to come for one on one and have questions that they would want to ask and uh, illiteracy is also uh, quite a big challenge here kuna wale watu ambao wako mistuni ambao tuwezi tukawafikia aswa sisi wale tuko hapa kwa sababu changamoto ni mingi means of transport kwa sababu ni watu wa kugura gura kila wakati there's no telecommunication coverage in some of our primary target areas tulifanya juu na chini juhudi tukajaribu wa mama wakubali walikubali kivyao wengine hata wanaume hawana habari mama anaweza fika el center na achange jina yake ama unaficha card kwa jirani wa mama saa zingine tunaweza kuwaita hapa tunawafanyia health talks wa mama anaanza kudemand kitu kama chai ama kitu kidogo tu anahitaji the implementing parties have some recommendations to make we as the minister of health would urge the partners the world vision to continue with the support because at least uh, there are also some gaps left to at least ensure more people come on board owing to the testaments of the community members the healthy spacing and timing of pregnancies project has had a tremendous impact in the communities it should therefore be encouraged na shukuru sana world vision kwa sababu imeleta ile vijana ama kina dada ile ile wamesoma na ni watu wa erei na wanatumia hiyo lugha wanaeleza kila mama everything kila mama na shai wiki lingine kuja anaanza kupungua anaanza baada ya 3 4 weeks ah watu wamezoea sasa wanaanza hao wenyewe wanaanza ku question sasa wale wafanyikazi watu wamefaidika wameelimika na tungependelea kama community hii miradi isikatizwe iendelee juu watu wameelimika wenye walikuwa gizani sasa wamepata mwangaza